Crystal. Oh, hi, Shadow. What are you doing out here all by yourself? Just doing some thinking. Really? Because your eyes are all red and sore. Have you been crying? Well, maybe a little. It's because I miss my dad. Oh, I see. Do you mind if I ask what happened? Well, I don't really like talking about it. But I can say that he had a really bad drinking problem. Oh, well, I don't know what that means, but I do know what it's like to lose someone close to you. Maria? Exactly. Normally, it's not that easy for me to show emotions, but I understand how you feel. And as the ultimate life form, it's my job to protect humanity. That was what I promised Maria before she passed. Yeah, but... My situation with losing my father wasn't as dramatic as yours. Although, sometimes I wish I could just go back in time and make sure that my dad never touched a single drop of alcohol. Well, you can't change the past, but you can choose the path to your future. I'm sure that if you keep making good decisions, your future will be as bright as the morning sun. It's okay. I've had worse happen to me. And I'm sorry for saying, well, you know what I said. Even though Jason tricked me. Say, do you have a story that's relevant to what we just talked about? Thanks, Shadow. And I'm sorry for beating you up. It's okay. I've had worse happen to me. And I'm sorry for saying, well, you know what I said, even though Jason tricked me. Yeah, I should probably have a word with him later. Say, do you have a story that's relevant to what we just talked about? Hmm, I think so. I have it right here. Something small. Sometimes Jesse tries to think of her dad and the way that he looked and the fun times they had or the jokes that he knew or the songs he could sing. And she finds that she just can't remember some things. And she feels so sad. It just aches in her heart. So she asks Mom and Elmo if they'll help her start. And because it's too much to remember it all, she begins with one thing that is special and small. She goes to her dresser and opens her drawer and takes out a hat that her daddy once wore. And sometimes she laughs and sometimes she cries as just for one moment she thinks of his eyes. Then she walks just like daddy straight down the hall and goes to the yard to try something else small. She lays in the grass and looks up at the sky, and with eyes just like Daddy's, she watches birds fly. Then she tosses a ball, and she draws with some chalk, and pretends she's a bear and skips a small rock. And she follows an ant, and she sits and she swings, even though all of these seem like small things. Somehow, they help her to think of her dad and the way that he was and the fun times they had. She remembers his hands and his face and his hair, and in some small, small way, it feels like he's there. Then Jessie heads in as she hums a small song and pretends that her daddy is singing along. And then Jessie snuggles because that's the small way that daddy and she 
and it's each single day. The end. So, how do you feel now? You know what? I actually feel better. It's okay to feel sad sometimes, especially after you've lost someone close to you. I can relate. But, in a way, the more you remember someone who's passed away, the closer they feel to you. So, whenever I think of my dad, I'm going to be happy. Or try to, at least. I'm going to do the same whenever I think about Maria. Good for you, Shadow. Now, if you'll excuse me, I need to have a word with a certain movie reviewer. I'll come with you. And Crystal? Yes? This isn't easy for me to say, but thanks. Hmm. <laughs> you know what I meant. Hmm. Why do I have the feeling I'm about to be in big trouble? Jason, we'd like to have a word with you. Oh, shit. Huh. Sounded easy to me. Hmm. <laughs> you know what I meant. Hmm. Why do I have the feeling I'm about to be in big trouble? Jason, Jason we'd, we'd like, like to have, have a word with you. you. Oh, shit.